Census questionnaires start going out next week, and privacy experts want people to be aware. With the census will come census scams. Here's Royce Jones on how to protect your family's information. It could be very detrimental to our efforts to ensure that every Pennsylvanian is counted. Census responses won't be accepted until April 1st, but the State Department of Community and Economic Development say scammers are already trying to fool the Commonwealth. Um, we are aware of this happening in the Philadelphia area, um, in Delaware, Montgomery and Bucks counties. Um, not sure if it, it is more widespread than that. In cases reported to the state, scammers are mailing out what looks like a legit census form. They're requesting financial information, including social security numbers, your mother's maiden name, and even political affiliation. Things the census says it will never ask for. Make sure that the return address uh, states it's, it's coming from Jeffersonville, Indiana. Mm. That's where the forms will originate from. 2020 is also the first year people can submit their responses online, opening the window for internet scammers too. If you're using this method, make sure the web address has a lock symbol like this when you type it into your browser. The U.S. Census Bureau has a team of cybersecurity experts that work with the federal intelligence community, and it's literally their job to review and protect data. With 2020 being the first year that this online component is being implemented for the census, the Carnegie Library will be acting as a hub to help people along the way. We've um, had a lot of census recruiters in. We have also been doing a series of trainings for libraries around the county to make sure that library staff are all trained and know what to look for. Census responses will be taken April 1st through July 31st. If you want to report a census scam, call them at 1-800-223-8252. In Allegheny County, Royce Jones, KDKA News.